scheduled awards, impairment ratings. When your injury has reached maximum and medical improvement, doesn't mean it got well, it's just you're at a level where you may still need medicine, you may still need shots, and, and your knee, but your knee's not going to get any better. You can have a scheduled award impairment rating. And what's used is this book, American Medical Association's Guide to the Valuation of Permanent Impairment. It is the nerdiest thing I've ever read. It's embarrassing, I, but it's hard to find a doctor who knows how to do this. It's so convoluted. Uh, you, it, you're going to have to find a doctor who knows how to do it correctly. The nice thing about Federal Workers' Comp, it has to be done exactly to the T and to the dotted I by the book so everybody's on the same level. Now, sometimes OWCP will get a second opinion person and the way they move your impairment lower is to say you don't have very many complaints and you don't have any symptoms, which is not fair, but that happens. So, and if it does, and they've lied or they didn't spend any time with you, you can go back and have another impairment rating. And also, as time goes on, you know, your knee gets worse, you can go back and do another scheduled award. If your impairment went up, you'd file for it. If it doesn't go up, don't file for it. So that's a scheduled award. Uh, that's going to be hard to find somebody to do, but there's some people do. Give us a call. We'll tell you some people around your area that can do it.